Um, Anthony Flew is a, uh, is a British philosopher who has long been um, a champion of atheism, and he has, as the questioner remarks, announced in his old age that he has um, been converted to a form of deism, not out-and-out theism, a form of deism where he thinks there probably is some kind of mysterious intelligence at the root of the universe. Many great people have thought the same. What disappointed me about Anthony Flew's reasons for that is that he publicly admitted, publicly announced, that what had convinced him was the idea of intelligent design, and specifically the book of Michael Behe. Well, that doesn't argue for um, the surviving powers that Anthony Flew once had as an intellectual. Um, no serious thinker could possibly be uh, positively impressed by the arguments of the so-called intelligent design creationists. There may be good reasons for believing in a god, and if there are any, I would expect them to come from possibly modern physics, from cosmology, from the um, observation that, uh, as some people claim, the laws and constants of the universe are too finely tuned to, um, to be an accident. That would not be a wholly disreputable reason for believing in a, some form of supernatural deity. I think there's a very good argument against it, and I've developed much of my chapter four to, as I think, refuting that argument. If Anthony Flew had said that, then I think we could have a serious argument with him. But what he actually said was that he was convinced by intelligent design in biology. And anybody who knows anything about biology um, will immediately see that that is ridiculous. Um, I'm, sorry to be so, I'm sorry to be so harsh, but when I last saw Anthony Flew, he, he didn't endear himself to me because he actually went about promulgating the legend that Darwin himself had a deathbed conversion. And that really is a ridiculous story, which was long, long ago um, disposed of by the Darwin family. And it led me to uh, somewhat discount other things that Anthony Flew is now saying. He once was a, a great philosopher. It's very sad. <laughs>